they're still watching inside. The last five years tested the Philippine economy's resilience under the Duterte administration. 2020 was the most brutal year. During that time, the Philippines suffered its first year of economic activity since the end of World War II. But the country's gross domestic product has since improved due to lack of vaccinations and better pandemic response. The country's economic candidates believe the country's growth rate will return to its pre-pandemic level by 2022. Still with us are former Social Economic Planning Secretary Shalito Hapito and Foundation for Economic Freedom President Toti Chikampo. Do you think ordinary Filipinos are able to take advantage of the fruits of Duterte's economic policy? Obviously, the, the, the COVID-19 pandemic induced crisis with a big setback. And the two main things that I keep uh, worrying about is the fact that poverty and hunger escalated, 